Hey everyone, my name is Mike Jensen, and welcome to this DVD on designing and creating mechanical armor within ZBrush. We'll begin by designing and concepting a set of armor on an existing character, and once we've nailed the concept sculpt to the one you see on screen, we'll go ahead and use a new set of tools and techniques exclusive to ZBrush 4.0 R2 to clean up and polish the character into something like this. On the road to the character that you see in front of you, we'll be covering extensive use of Dynamesh, the new slice features, and the ability to create custom insert brushes for detailing the character. We'll also touch upon various other topics, such as customizing the ZBrush user interface, creating an asymmetrical pose like the one you see currently, and also the simulation of cloth in 3D Studio Max, so you can achieve a more dynamic cloth result. After we finalized and posed the model, we'll go over creating a clay render within 3D Studio Max and the use of V-Ray. And with those renders from 3D Studio Max, we'll then jump into Photoshop, so we can use a few tricks and techniques to bring some vibrance to our clay renders. By the end of this DVD, you should have everything you need to be able to design a set of unique armor, clean that concepted armor with various techniques from ZBrush 4.0 R2, and then finalize the model for a truly portfolio-worthy piece. Alright, enough talking, I'm excited, so let's go ahead and jump into this DVD.